In this example, let's look at identifying objects while debugging with Visual Studio. We're going to take a look at a rad grid with a few different columns. Let's start off by placing a breakpoint and running this project in debug mode. Once the app hits the breakpoint, open the quick watch to begin inspecting the objects. Notice that the item inspected is of type telleric.web.ui.griddataitem. Next, Let's access the font icon cell by passing the column unique name as a named index to the grid data item object and press enter. Quick Watch will display a table with three columns. The first column shows the name of the object, property, or method used. The second shows the value and the third shows the type. The current expression used has the base type system.web.ui.webcontrols.table cell, which is inherited by the RAD grid in the Telerik classes. It's set to the type telerik.web.ui.gridtable cell. Having that in mind, this expression can be cast to both types. Now, when using the Quick Watch, you can see the types to help you cast them accordingly. You can also test different expressions, run methods, and other basic programming interactions. Once you know the type of the object, you can use that expression in the custom business logic that you are working on.